Tonight with a live pinpoint Doppler 12 weather alert. Right now, a severe thunderstorm watch is in effect across southern New England until 8 o'clock. And we have live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar. It's tracking the threat of potentially dangerous storms in real time. Let's get right to Chief Meteorologist Tony Petraka with the very latest. Well, as mentioned, the uh, watch in effect until 8 o'clock this evening, though, what is encouraging on live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar has been a significant weakening of the storms. Let's take a look now. Areas of yellow and orange represent where the strongest storms are located. There are not that many. You have one here in um, Plymouth County in Massachusetts heading off in this direction. It's got a history of hail. And this next area of some heavier showers out on the uh, Connecticut Rhode Island border. This is not severe, fortunately, as it tracks off to the the uh, south and east as well. In fact, we get a close-up look at both. And this one out across uh, western Kent County is just really a generic shower with a th with a uh, downpour and perhaps a clap of thunder. However, the area out across um, in Plymouth County in Massachusetts, this is in fact a severe thunderstorm as it tracks uh, towards Cape Cod. As far as uh, the lightning tracker, and we've seen a, a significant decrease. In fact, let me show you that one more time. It just went by. We've seen a significant decrease in the amount of lightning with these storms as well. So what we're seeing here is a trend of weakening storms, but the watch is still in effect until 8 o'clock this evening, so that's not to say that additional scattered thunderstorms can't develop over the next couple of hours. In downtown Providence, it was 90 degrees about an hour and a half ago. It's dropped off to 81. The wind now is picked up out of the northwest at 21. And I would say by 7, 8 o'clock this evening, any risk of a, of a thunderstorm should come to an end with clearing skies, and the remainder of the night should be okay. So the window of opportunity really is the next two to two and a half hours for an isolated strong shower or thunderstorm. It's the kind of situation where not every neighborhood will get one. Of course, we'll get a closer look at the Doppler radar, the full forecast, a lot to cover, all the details coming up in just a bit.